Okay guys, welcome back to part three. As you can see, the engines have already put back together and I'm just gonna take care of a couple of housekeeping things. Trucks, drivetrain, worm gear, engine, engine mounts, and the other truck and drivetrain have all been assembled. The decoder's been popped into place. And just to review real quick, red and black from this truck and red and black from this truck to red and black here. You have white and blue to the light here, and gray to the bottom side, the common, and orange to the top side of the motor. If you guys have ends that are too long, you need, need to cut them off or uh, shorten them up or loop them up, whichever way works, just so they're not getting caught here in the flywheels. And that's pretty much it. I'll put it down here real quick, and we'll do a quick little bench test. And as you can see, F0 controls the light on and off, and there we go, that little dirty spot on the track. Bench test is good, we're pretty much ready for the shell to be put back on. So, there you have it. There's all three parts of how to install a Digitrax decoder DH123D into an Authorant Blue Box Kit SD40. Leave your comments and uh, questions and remarks all in the uh, box right below the screen here. And we'll see you guys soon with some more DCC How To.